very warm welcome to our Tuesday evening phone in. This is the big one, and we are, of course, live on YouTube. We're live on Facebook, Twitch, and LinkedIn. And we're also joined by the TikTokers. I see them just arriving now. How cool is that? Do come and join us as soon as possible. Remember, of course, it is indeed the phone in. So for that, you can phone in. How amazing is that? And a big dinky do to you from Scotty McClure. Lovely to have you with us. Welcome, 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 I say. You've got the number in front of you there, 0141 The internet uh, phone in is proving very, very popular. We are about four weeks old and already everybody is thoroughly enjoying it. So that's what we like. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for sending me all these likes. On TikTok, I've got 127 likes already. Now, what's very interesting is that uh, we started off this evening on TikTok with two likes and ended up, I think, with about 12,000, something like that. And then I popped up on TikTok the other day and we ended up with 40,000 likes. Absolutely incredible. Fantastic. Do feel free to give us a phone, guys. Uh, you know, we should have everything working for you. Yep, seems to be all in good heart there. Give us a ring and let's chit chat, I see. We've usually got somebody on by now. Uh, there we are. Fantastic. I'll just see what's happening there. Yes, that seems to be okay. So you should be able to phone directly to me for a good old chit chat. We'll see what's happening with the chat. Hello all, says Suzanne. Thank you, Scotty, says the wonderful Lady Doyle. I still have a horrible cold. Suzanne, why do we say we have a horrible cold? Have you ever heard anybody say they have a good cold? Thank you, do. Thank you for my five beautiful TikToks, Mr. Goatface. Maybe quite quiet tonight. Football on now. Scottish TikToker. McClue will never, ever, ever be intimidated by football on the telly. There are plenty of people who don't have any time for football and who would love to come and join us in the phone in. So we'll not bother with that. Um, I had COVID. I've, I have COVID. I had it for six days. Sorry to hear that, Scottish TikToker. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. You're watching Scotty McClue. Subscribe to the YouTube channel and tap the bell big style. That's what it's all about. You'll just see some movement around as I adjust things a little bit here. How fantastic is that? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello, Paul. Hello, Thomas. Dinky do. Dinky do says Danny. Danny, excellent. Lovely to have you with us. We welcome every single new person to the phone in. Tremendous that. I'll be scared to ring you. Honestly, <laughs> the debates would be horrible. Where are you getting that from? You okay, mate? The debates will be fabulous. Just ring up and stop being silly about it. Come on. You grow yourself a set. Greetings, Scotty. What's your favorite dinosaur? My favorite dinosaur is the one-eyed dinosaur, the Jathinkisaurus. That's always a good one. Will McClue's pies ever be an exclusive range to bake at home? John? I'll not mention the supermarkets. McClue's pies are exclusive. So there you are. The vegetarian lattice slice in the rich chicken sauce. We like that. Now then, let's see how the phones are doing. Has anybody tried the phones to tell me if they're working? Thank you, Scotty. Dave Deprave. Thank you, Thank you for your apology for last night. We got that on the YouTube channel. And uh, we, we realize I understand. It's just we are a family show. Uh, here's somebody calling. Let's check. You're live in Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Nobody. All right. There we are. Nobody. The ghost of Christmas past. We love it. If you're coming on, then, as I say, grow a set and stay on and have a chat. You're very welcome. But at least we know the phones are working. That's excellent stuff. Welcome. Welcome, TikTokers. I say, Scotty, how's it going? It's wonderful. I'll take on your English bias politics. We don't have any English bias politics. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Oh, it's Thomas from Glasgow. Thomas from Glasgow. How are you? I'm fine, Scotty. 
You're an absolute top man and a big dinky doo to you. How are you? Excellent. Yes, indeed. I'm enjoying the phone in, and I hope you are. Oh, it's good to see you back on, mate. Honestly, it's just something a little bit different. We're getting bored, senseless by what's on the radio and telly. I oh, know you've been watching all that. Oh, and I thought to myself, no, no, I want to have something that cheers people up. Yes, we checking people half as Scottish. Yes, a wee bit of dinky do and a wee bit of chit chat. That's correct. Yes, that's fine. You know what, what I mean? What a top man. That was so good of you to ring and dinky do. You too, Scotty. See you about Bless you. Thanks again. All the best, that's buddy. Cool. What a top man. That was very good of him to call there. And we know the phones are working, so no excuses. This is class, says Boy Ghost. Flow tie, dinky do, scrag. How lovely to have you with us in a big dinky do. Can everybody get tapping and tapping and tapping? If you want to join in the phone in, if you look at my bio on TikTok, just below it, you'll see the link to the YouTube channel. Click on that, subscribe, tap the bell, and you can watch the phone in. How good is that, Mr. Goatface? Thank you for my lovely TikToks. The well head of knowledge from which all things worth knowing spring forth. Good evening, sir. Kirby. What a lovely, lovely thing to say, and a very good evening to you. Everybody at Tapping, I've got 2,000 likes. That's amazing. 2,000 likes. Happy Ulster Day, Scotty, from Ryan. Ryan, dinky do. Ryan, do you know that Ulster is not the six counties? It's obviously the ancient kingdom of Ulster, and I think there are either eight, and somebody even suggested nine counties in Ulster. What about that? So happy Ulster Day. Scotty, what tie are you wearing? Is it a hashtag flow tie? Steve, I see what you just did there. How clever are you? Fantastic. A flow tie. We love it. Yes, indeed. You have to guess what tie I'm wearing. There it is there. I thought I'd smarten myself up for you. Tremendous stuff. Dinky Doo says, Andrew. Hello, Andrew. Lovely to have you with us. Safar says, hello, Scotty. Hello, Safar. Always lovely to have you on. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And Dinky Doo, Safar. Uh, Dinky Doo from Scotty McClure always brings a smile to my face, says, a walk with nature live on TikTok Live. Scotty, do you have any jokes? You know I don't tell jokes, Mr. Goatface. I went into the doctors the other day. I said, can you help me out? He said, which way did you come in? Oh, yes, you see. What's your take on the clowns emptying the petrol stations? Shocking, weak, greedy, tiny-minded human beings. Yes, think about other people. Say, no, half a tank will do me, and I'll catch up at some point once the deliveries start. All right, pathetic. Hi there, Scotty Dinky do. What football team do you like? I don't really bother with football teams. You know, I mean, are, are you a high B by any chance? I noticed that. Hi there, Scott. Hi, Dinky do. Ixelbert. Lovely to have you with us, Ixelbert. Hello, Scotty. Hello, everybody. Dinky do. And a very warm welcome to Scotty McClure's internet phone in. How good is that? I see you have a PGCE. Did you ever teach? Oh, I teach and teach and teach. Yes, on and off for years and years and years. Uh, all the petrol stations, primary, secondary, and tertiary higher education. Lecturing on media, lecturing on drama, lecturing on leadership, lecturing and teach. Oh, don't start me. History, another great one. Music. Wonderful. Football is bread and games for the folks. Well, it might well be, but Scotty McClue is the bread of life for the folks. Have we thought about that? Awesome. Um, I'm at 20 years. Excellent stuff. We love it. There we go. The School of Hard Knocks. Yes, indeed. Follow us as soon as you come on, guys. Every TikToker on TikTok should be following Scotty McClue right now. This is massive. 
and this is the internet phone in and it will grow and grow and grow it's four weeks old i had a half-witted idiot earlier when i popped up saying this guy thinks he's famous with about 13 people watching at that point you know it comes and goes said yes and two billion fans worldwide so forgive me for thinking i'm famous it uh, gives a snippet of the wonderful story of sir walter scott ah good to talk to you abbotsford house in the borders good to talk to you where in scotland are you from do you know that sir walter scott i can't remember if it was his publisher but he was virtually bankrupted and in terrific debt he fought his way back and bought his estate back wow so there you are uh, don't like them football sports not involved absolutely ick and certainly scotty McLean will never ever be intimidated oh you shouldn't pop up live on the internet there's football on nobody will join you nonsense there we are. I've got one of my highest audiences ever here on TikTok. Fantastic. We love it. Welcome, TikTokers, Dinky Doo. Welcome, YouTubers. Welcome, Facebookers. Welcome, LinkedIners. Welcome, Twitchers. Now, Twitchers, can you do me a massive favor tonight? Can you actually go to Twitch if you are a Twitcher? Watch me live on Twitch. So if you've got a Twitch account, Watch me live on the Twitch account because I want to get affiliated and I've done very little on Twitch. There we are. Hi, D. Dinky Doo. Nice to see you, Scotty. Dinky Doo. How are you? Tony, how lovely to hear from you. So far, I agree. Two hours. Scotty, it's good having you back on. Please can you be on for longer than an hour? It's too short. So far, I know what you mean. I feel it's too short as well, but I don't want to overplay my hand until we've built it up. If we see real signs of growth, then we can look at extending it. That's the thing. I want to get everybody following and subscribing on YouTube. I want everybody following on TikTok. So actually go to the top left, click the plus sign and follow me. I want all the TikTokers to look at my bio on TikTok. Just below it is the URL link to the youtube channel get yourselves onto that subscribe tap the bell and we will be in business guys scotty upsetting man i've been watching your live for a while you keep ignoring me boy ghost i've already read out what you said what do you mean keep ignoring you i never ever ever ignore anybody except a silly wee troll who would be down the river and i don't think that is you so i'm certainly not ignoring you there we are. Never be upset, boy ghost. Got family in Elgin, says Daniel. Excellent. We love it. Let me look back at boy ghost. How do you phone in, Scotty? Boy ghost, you go to the YouTube channel and you, uh, you phone in, you subscribe, tap the bell. You'll see the number along the bottom of the screen. That's the number there, you see. Scotty McClure, YouTube phone in, call Scotty and I, 0141 628 9795. There we go. How excellent is that? So, boy, ghost, you know that you are certainly not ignored. Do you speak Hungary? I try not to shop Hungary. I think that's important. Hi, Scott. Hi, Meatloaf. How lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Do. There we are. Now, then, I've noticed Meatloaf on YouTube. Here we go. Ah, we're at the tea tonight. It's beautiful. Dinky do. I'm a wee bit late, says Professor Numptyhead. What's happening, dude? Numptyhead, I've just been explaining that I never, ever, ever get intimidated by football being on. People said, it might be a wee bit quiet, Scotty. There's football on. Nothing to do with Scotty McClue's internet phone in. We are international, global right across the world the only reason everybody on the internet's not watching right now is because they don't all know about it that's your job professor numpty heat if you're a wee bit late there is no punishment for being late because if you've missed a second of scotty mcclue you've been punished enough i'll say that is it errol gray scotty hey, no it's not the errol gray tonight it's the yorkshire tea there's Freik. Freik says hello from the Netherlands. Hi, yeah. 
Kamen der Hus will schon Kuppe de haben. I'm wearing mein Klompen, Eric. Scotty boy, dinky doola, beachy, beachy. I got your lovely comments on Twitch. Beachy, beachy, can you watch me on Twitch tonight? Right? The last few nights, we haven't had many watching on Twitch, and I need watchers to affiliate me. So if you've got a Twitch account, guys, go to Scotty underscore McClue and watch, actually watch the show live. That will be amazing. New Bond movie out this weekend. Good to see it. Uh, Susie, I don't think I'll see it this weekend, but I do love Bond. Did the bun at once belong to Super Grand? Numpty, he I have worked with Super Grand. Lovely, lovely actress. Yes, indeed. We love watching, Scotty. Thank you, Thomas. What is the show all about? Meatloaf. It's about human beings. It's about people who want to talk, who want to interact with each other, who want to interact with Scotty McClue, who have something to say on the telephones. Last night was a bit heavy. We're talking about drugs. We're talking about capital punishment, bringing it back for druggies, all that sort of thing. Alfie, my 12-year-old son's busy is doing homework while listening to the Lord of the Radio. Thank you, do DJ Altini. We thank you. Super grand theme was sung by Billy Conley. I wish that near fantastic. I was watching Billy earlier tonight. Uh, I'm going to bed for an early night, Scotty. Thanks for another great show. Nikki Jaws. Have a lovely, lovely sleep and dinky do to every single one of you. There we are. Uh, just keep going live when the foot is on. It keeps her indoors quiet and I can watch it in peace. All right. So she's a footy fan and you can watch the phone in. Well done, Ebri. There we are. Super Grand was the best. Loved it. Absolutely, dear Gurley. Did you get your dinky doola? Fantastic. Free Catalonia. Uh, right. Well, that's a long shot at the moment, but thank you for that. Scotty, do you think Neville Chamberlain was too soft in Germany in the early days? I think Neville Chamberlain was of the old gentleman school of politics, wasn't into real politics, and I think the problem is that he trusted Hitler. I think he sent Robert Boothby, Lord Boothby, as he became. I think he sent Bob Boothby out to see Hitler, because I know he met Hitler. And when he walked into the room, it was a great big long room, I remember him telling this story on the television. And Hitler was sitting at one end and he shot to his feet, threw a Nazi salute and shouted, Hitler. And so Bob extended his arm and said, Boothby. <laughs> I thought it was wonderful. Super grand. He had a great sense of humor, Robert Boothby. Is there a possibility you might be a chess grandmaster? It will actually no cast forth. I once had dinner with a world chess champion. And unfortunately, it was a black and white tablecloth, and it took him almost an hour to pass me the salt. So I don't play chess, I can tell you. Guys, can you share this? If you're watching on YouTube, subscribe, tap the bell. If you're watching on Twitch, follow me and watch on Twitch. Don't go on to anything else. Just watch on Twitch tonight. It's an excellent feed. And I'd like to have people watching on Twitch. Uh, also, if you can get on to the Facebook and you can like me on Facebook Live, LinkedIn, I've put out that I'm looking for development opportunities for the phone in. So have a look at my LinkedIn, Scotty McClue. Scotty, is Davis partner, John, watching a Twitch? A massive dinky do, John Boy, thank you for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. To all our Twitch watchers, actually, please watch it on Twitch. Scotty underscore McClue and follow me on Twitch. We need to really start building now, guys. Love that, Scotty. Dinky doody. So that's wonderful. Thank you, John Boy. That's brilliant. Disco Pete. Now, Disco Pete is one of the most generous men on TikTok, and he's just sent me 10 beautiful TikToks. Every time Disco Pete comes on, he sends me a gift. Maria Knight is another one. I Am Steel is another one. All these beautiful people that send me gifts on TikTok. You never, ever, ever need to feel obliged to send Scotty McClue anything. 
This is an entirely free service because I want to see it build up while I'm still on the earth, if you get my meaning. There we are. Definitely not ringing you. You'll end up making me cry. Never, ever, ever. Hey, I've sent you gifts. Yes, you okay, mate? Another very, very, very generous person on TikTok. I thank you for that. If somebody's feeling flush, there's a paypal.me forward slash Scotty McClure. You're live on Scotty's phone in. Who's that? It's me, Scotty. It's David. Ah, you? David, brilliant. John Boy's watching on Twitch. I know he is. That's so good because I'll tell you, David. I, Scotty, I, I love Super Grand. Super Grand was wonderful. Sunday. Yes, Gudrun Uhr, the actress, and I worked with her. Uh, she came to be interviewed on ITV for, I think yeah. it was this morning. Uh -huh. And we were on the same show, and she looked just amazing. She, uh, she uh, made a tartan bonnet. The she tartan bonnet and all the tartan, super but grand. Even, even, I, I love the theme song. I can sing that. It's amazing. Wonderful. <laughs> don't sing it just now because we don't want a copyright strike. Well, I've never missed an addition of Super Grand. She was incredible, seriously, Tommy. But anyway, are you okay? I'm great, David. Yes, fantastic tonight. And I'm so chuffed that John Boy's managed to get in Twitch. I hope there's another That's two or three watching as well. And that will yeah. let us get affiliated. Exactly, yeah. You see, sure. we, what we need to do now, David, we know everything works. We need to uh, start building it up and telling 10. Course. You know, I'm, I'm thinking, come on, people phone in, people please. Oh, absolutely, phone, phone in, yes, up. indeed. I know it went from phone ins in the past. I know some uh, people think, oh, I wouldn't need phone in, but there's no reason not to. Exactly, again, mm -hmm. back, do you remember other Linda who's on the, the, the big accordion? Yes. Well, I know she can't play copyright, but Linda, please come on if you can hear us and just have a wee chat. Have a chat, that's what it's all about, and I think you do. Yeah. Everybody, please come on. Yes. People, come on right now. Come on right now. There's no time like the present to phone Scotty right. McClure. Right. I'll let you go. I'm watching you got a cause. You better come on. You're an absolute Thank top you. man. And David, thank John Boy again, please. I will do, Scotty. Yeah. I'm so chuffed with that. Thank you. Sorry, Scotty, do you want to say hello? Yes. Mr. McClure, how are we doing? John, I can't thank you enough for watching on Twitch. No problem. I heard you talking there uh, about Twitch and asking if anyone was on Twitch. Yes. To get on there and give us a watch. So I thought I'd do that for you, Scott. Yes, because I'll tell you what happens. A load yeah. of people watch during the day, but they're not watching it live yet because it's not yeah. big enough. Now, yeah. if we can get enough people watching live, just another two or three, then we can yeah. start to get affiliated and we can grow yeah. the Twitch. Yeah. Well, Scotty, I'll certainly share this. I'll ask all my friends to share it. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell the whole neighbourhood. How's that sound, Scotty? That's wonderful. And get all your Twitch friends watching live. They'll be all twitching to get a talk to you, Paula. We're yeah, twitching. Scotty. You're a top oh, man. Fine. Hey, thanks, ah, John. Thank Dinky do oh, la. Scotty. Thank you, do all the best. Fantastic stuff. That is brilliant. Scotty, it's me, Mr. Goatface from TikTok. Mr. Goatface, thank you. Thank you for your kindness and your generosities. How many do you need for an affiliate? Susanne, I think it's two or three watching constantly. So, you know, just we just need two or three. I've, uh, I've ticked all the other boxes and we just need three. And, uh, you know, we, we just get a couple. It's still under. So we need to get three people watching the Twitch. And there's no reason not to watch the Twitch because it's an excellent feed. Somebody said it's a brilliant uh, stream, you know what I mean? I've got Twitch on the big telly uh, and also on the laptop through YouTube. Brilliant numpty heat. So let them know you're watching Twitch and subscribe to it. Uh, who have we got here? Oh, my goodness, this is interesting, guys. Well done, I say, you lot. Right, what have we got here? Hang on. Uh, I've got so many messages. Sc Scotty, I'm listening while trying to put stretch covers on my CTs. I'm knackered. The covers are a brilliant idea, but they are hard work. You have to stretch them. As, have they got wee stretchers in below? 
Hitler was shell-shocked by a British shell. He wandered towards the British trenches and the British soldier let him go back. What a mistake. I know. Seven watching so far on Twitch. That is brilliant. Anya, thank you, thank you, thank you for this. We are moving forward, guys, after three, four weeks. There we are. Right, I've switched over to Twitch, Scotty. Susie Mac, what an angel you are. That is brilliant. Affiliate means you're limited to streaming on Twitch alone. You won't be able to multi-stream to other places at the same time. All right, Scarlett, are you sure about that? There we are. His name was Henry Tandy. Right, Dave Deprave. I've got you, the British soldier that could have blown up Hitler. I remember a soldier showed me an, a, a grenade. He said, this is called an alphabet grenade. I said, why? He says, if this goes off, it could spell disaster. <laughs> yes, right, Scarlett. But nevertheless, it doesn't matter. Let's get everybody watching and see if we can build this up. Good evening to you. Nicholas has sent me beautiful roses on TikTok. Guys, can everybody follow me on TikTok? Yes. And let's get Tappy the screen. 3,300 likes. We love that. Is that you in the back? That's me in the back. Lord Ruth the Labrador. Oh, yes. And there, I think there's another one for you there. Look, look, look. <laughs> I got gifted these in case you think, what's he doing with his own picture behind him? There we are. Well, it's better than having it in front of me, isn't it? <laughs> See what I just did there? Here you're in the back. Hitler escaped death about 11 times. How very interesting. I wonder if he was actually killed at the end of the war or uh, if if he got away. You never know. Love your show, says Frank Dinkiru. I'm not one for conspiracy theories, I can tell you. Can everybody share on all platforms, YouTube, Facebook, Twitch, LinkedIn, if you're watching me on LinkedIn Live, yes, get sharing, guys. I'm watching you on YouTube and watching you on TikTok. Brilliant, Thomas. I uh, used to listen to your show when doing deliveries years ago, my man. Thank you, Johnny McQuarter. Hello, it's me again from the Netherlands. Hi, yeah. Come into whose village and cup of the heaven. I'm wearing my clumpen. Love you so well. Share. Thank you, Frank. Everybody get sharing, guys. We can never have too much sharing. We need to get the numbers moving upwards now because we know everything works. I think when you're testing stuff and you're going through all the technical rehearsals, you think, oh, there's no problem. It'll work. We'll give it a try. But it's nice to get it going. Uh, Mr. Goatface says, Scotty, I think Hitler escaped because many other high-ranking generals managed it. Yes, but the, the generals did plot to clobber them, didn't they? What is the worst country ever? Look, a legend. It's not a question of countries being better or worse. It's just if some countries might be less good for certain things. You see? I mean, you could say to yourself, well, economically at the moment, Greece is perhaps not the best place. But Greece is stunningly, stunningly beautiful. And it's filled with beautiful people. Yasu, Greece. Uh, uh, Kalispera. There we are. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Love your show. Fantastic. Somebody give us a call. Are the phones working? We'll check. I think the phones are working, guys. Feel free to give us a call for a chit chat. Right. We haven't had Kareem tonight. I wonder if he's watching the football. There we are. That is fantastic. Brilliant. Right. Let's go tap, 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 tap. I'm at 3,300 likes. I think that is amazing. Fantastic. Dinky do. Thank you for joining us live on TikTok. We absolutely love it. So good to have you on TikTok. Thank you. Wonderful stuff. So I don't know that we need to go worst country ever. I mean, a beautiful, beautiful country to stay in now is Germany, but it wasn't quite so much fun in 1948. Mm. Gosh, I can't even get a sip of tea without being interrupted. 
You're live on Scottish phone in, who's that? It's my second call, it's David again. David, of Good course. Boy. Where, where is Kareem? Kareem on the phone. I know, we need Kareem on. We love to hear Kareem on the phone. Yeah, and listen, listen, I'll put it again. People, please phone Scotty. Absolutely. What is wrong with you as people? What is wrong? I know, and it, there it says, the number's in front of their face. Yeah, they've got to, they've got to phone you, and that's all about it. <laughs> People stop sitting down. Let's chat, chat, chat. Chat, 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 I see. Absolutely. Scotty, can you do it? David, do you know what I've just realised? Uh -huh. The number's no in front of their face. There it is now. Right, right. Well, <laughs> you, better, you better bloody phone. I must have clicked on, on, on Mr. Goatface's comment and it went up instead. Right. <laughs> if you've got a great comment, David, you see, I can actually put it up. Please call phone, Scotty. Absolutely. Give us a call. Greetings from Nova Scotia. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you, David. Thank you very much. What an absolute <laughs> top man. That is wonderful. That's excellent stuff. Thank you, David. Very much appreciated, I say. Now, that's it. Uh, next hundred years. Absolutely. And I hope not. Ah, Scotty McClure. Thank you, do. So there we go. Now, we're not going on to that stab where we don't mention personalities' names uh, unless, you know, it's in the right context. The man with a bonnet, done it, dinky do, Bill. Lovely to have you with us. And a big dinky do, I say. Great chat. Difference between Welsh and British. Well, you can't actually be one without being the other. See, there's no such country as Britain. It's a land mass which contains four countries, yeah? Great Britain contains three. It's the big bit, and that's all that's to it. So people who say, I love being British, well, all it means is you live on that land mass. And people that say, I don't want to be British, well, you are because you live on the land mass. But... The major countries are Scotland, England, Northern Ireland, or Wales. So if you are British, you're going to be from one of them. Have you got it? There we are. Scotty McClure, dink you do to every single one of you. To the telephones, if you've got something to say, guys, this is going to be absolutely massive, right? I could tell you that right now. The internet phone in, it's four weeks old, you know, and we get a nice steady stream of phone calls. The number's right in front of you there. And uh, a lot of people will want to watch. A lot of people will want to listen. I have a pedigree of entertaining the UK over the last 30 years this summer. So there you are. Not bad. Uh, greetings from Nova Scotia, says Otis. Otis. We love you in Nova Scotia because that is New Scotland. Can we do more sharing? Housekeeping. If you're watching on Twitch, follow me. Try and watch on Twitch. If you're watching on YouTube, subscribe and tap the bell and let us know. Get your notifications. There we are. Terrific stuff. Feel free to phone us for a chit chat, guys. We're ready to take your call. Fantastic. And there's the number there, 0141628-9795. You're watching Scotty McClure. Hashtag Floati, the first lord of the internet. How good is that? Wonderful stuff. I thank you. We're watching on TikTok. Scotty Dinky do. Scotty, you're my only friend, not at all. Pronouns, says Charlie. You don't need any of that on here, Charlie. We are all inclusive. Pronouns are divisive and they're old-fashioned, right? We're all inclusive on here. Nobody has to justify who they are. Your background, your race, your creed, your color, your orientation doesn't matter on here. We are all inclusive. I loved you on the radio back in the day. You are an informative bloke. I thank you. You were so honest. I know, Chris. Uh, got it, says Johnny. Greetings from Edinburgh. If you don't have a clue, phone Scotty McClure. Shuggy, we love you in Edinburgh and dinky do. Get sharing every day. 
Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Go and uh, nick a URL off YouTube or Facebook or Twitch and send it round all your friends. LinkedIn as well. Where's the telephone number, Scotty? You'll not see it on TikTok. You'll see it on YouTube. That's it there. If you want to write it down, the Scotty McClure YouTube phone in, call Scotty now, 0141628 9795 0141628 And every single one of you watching, get in touch with all your friends across social media. Greetings from Toronto, says Johnny Quest. Johnny Quest, we love you in Toronto. Scotland has big media connections with Toronto. I think you'll find that uh, Lord Thompson Roy Thompson, Sir Roy Thompson, was from Toronto and had radio and television stations, and he set up Scottish television in 1957. How amazing is that? And he was a Toronto man. Am I right? He ended up owning the Times. There we are. Fantastic. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. If you're on TikTok, get following, get sharing, get tap, 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 tap. Hello. Hello. Thank you, Johnny Quest, for following. That goes for every TikToker. You should all be following Scotty McClure. Otherwise, what are you doing with an account? Simple as that. Dinky do. This is the big one. Right. Uh, come and join us. Back to the super chat. See what's what. Remember, this is absolutely free. But uh, there's been beautiful, beautiful, generous people on TikTok. Beautiful, generous people on GoFundMe.com forward slash Scotty hyphen McClue have helped us with bits of equipment. PayPal.me forward slash Scotty McClue. Thank you, Mr. Goatface. Right. What about this one? There's a show called Hunting Hitler. They give a good argument for Hitler surviving and hiding out in Argentina. Well, of course, he would have passed away by now. Because uh, I think, was he not? 1885 he was born. Am I right? Uh, there we are. Anya says, redacted government documents have a lot to say. Well, yes. Especially if you know what the redactions, the redactions are. He thought he was invincible as a result of the attempted assassinations. He wrote that down. He was passionately involved in the occult. He was a very bad, mad man. Yes, so we believe. Jumped over to Twitch now, Scotty. Thank you, Ebri. Scotty, do you know what happened to wee fat Bob? You pair and that made the late nights and the night is enjoyable. I don't, Tommy, I haven't heard a wheesht. I haven't heard ichi or ochi about wee Bob. Scotty, it's not letting me through. It's ringing out. Kareem, we need Kareem through. Have you been trying and trying? Try it again, Kareem. See if you can get through this time. Evening, Scotty. Evening, Jerry. Dinky do. Evening, Jerry. Numpteed says Dinky do. Phone ends not. Phones not working. Scotty, you've knackered the phones. Everybody trying to get through. Try it now, Kareem, and see what happens. For goodness' sake, there we are. See if we can get you on. I've I've done everything I can at this end, so it should be working. There we are. Try that, Kareem. Scotty, you're not paid the phone bill. Jerry Nickel, I haven't half paid the phone bill. My goodness me. I have paid it. I'm not sure if you guys have to pay a local cost or whatever as well, but there it goes. Uh, no doubt we'll all find out. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. Is it the Argyle and Southern Highlanders Regimental Tie? No, J.D. Donnelly. It does not look like that. I do have one of these. It's green and purple and gold. And it's not the Argyle and Southern. It's the Argyle and Sutherland. Because the 93rd Highlanders were raised in Sutherlandshire, right up in the north of Scotland. Hi, Suzanne. Hi, Jerry. Try that again, Kareem. See if we can get you through. Should be working. I keep coming back onto it. Let me see if there's anything I can do here. No, I think that's it, Karim. I think it should be working. Do give us a shout. There we are. 
Everybody can try the phone scream. Can't get through. Can't get through, Scotty, says Robert. Aha. Uh -huh. I wonder why. I wonder what we need to do here. See if we can get this working. No. It should work, guys. There shouldn't be a problem. Keep trying and keep trying and we'll see if we can get you on here. I'm looking at it right now. Yes, it seems to be going to uh, to messaging. Right, what I'm going to do, and this is, I'm going to have a look at the settings. This is big stuff, this guy. There we go. Hello, you're live with Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Oh, it's Jerry. Jerry, how fantastic is that? Did you get through no bother? No, no, I had a bit of a bother. A phone BT, they put on the right track. Ah, right, excellent stuff. No problem at all. I went right to the top. Right to the top, Jerry. Never put up yeah. with any nonsense, you. Well done. No, exactly. How are you? That's what it's all about, you know, and a call to Scotty McClure is important. Oh, of course, they said that. They said they had, had put the plug in. Put the plug in, put the plug in. Everybody <laughs> puts in the plug. Fantastic. Are you dinky do? Dinky do. How are you tonight? We're very well, Jerry. Yes, excellent. I'm yeah. chuffed to bits with the way the phone in's going. Good, good. You know, it's really amazing. Well. As I say, you know, we're four weeks old, for goodness sake. Ah, exactly. But I enjoyed, I was doing a bit of chores in the house last night, and I just, uh, listen to the program. Oh, I'm making any comment. Oh, it was big stuff last night, Jerry. Oh, Monday night, the, my daughter's back at school. You know, I've got my chores to do. Yeah, chores, and it was not. Did you do the high dusting? Oh, that's it with a feather, feather duster. Your feather oh, duster, yes. <laughs> I don't know that I'd trust you with a feather duster. <laughs> well, that, Dave, he's an office, not. He's some man. He was doing his nut, actually. Oh. Yes, indeed. Oh, yes, but uh, that's not precise. You're very kind, Jerry, and dinky do la. Thank you. Thank you do. Thank you do. There's Jerry. Excellent stuff. Uh, the Nazis created a base at the South Pole as early as 1940. Apparently, my dad and granddad were there, Giles. Very proud. I saw you had the number, Scotty. Excellent stuff. You live with Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hello. Obviously, Mr. Nobody, right? There you go. That's why the South Pole is like Fort Knox to get in. How very, very interesting. No, Scotty, it's still just ringing out. Well, it's just what for Jerry, Kareem. That's very strange. My dad and granddad. Were... Yes, I read that one. Uh, Bonnets, here we are. You're live with Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hello, Scotty. Hello, who's that? This is Danny from Billericay. Oh, Danny from Billericay. We love it. How are you? I'm very well. How are you? Fantastic. Phone in tonight, Danny. Yes, I know. It's quite, quite it's tough getting through. It's tough getting through, absolutely. I think maybe we're overloading the system. I think I've been a bit ambitious, but I don't care. <laughs> Do you know, because the fact is we're on and people can get in touch. Absolutely. And we like that. How is Bill and Ricky tonight? Good. I've had a long day at the radio station. Yeah. I've come home and I've just put you on. Brilliant. This will chill you out big style. Chill me out. That's why I love listening to the nutters put ringing. Yeah. Yeah. We've had a few of them, I can tell you. I don't mean your regular callers. No, the regulars are just gorgeous. People in radio, you know, they ring up and hang up. They ring up and hang up because they don't believe it's real. They can't, they're, they're very tiny minded. Yeah. And they don't believe it's real. I know. And, 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 and you get this wherever you go, don't you? Don't oh, think. every radio station. And I'll tell you what you also used to get. Uh, there were 26 radio services in one market I worked in. And yeah. the other radio stations used to ring to see if Scotty was busy because others were ringing out. Oh. <laughs> we love it. Wow. Yep. Absolutely, absolutely love it. Absolutely. Why, why can't you do? 
Why do you do it? Oh, I'm going to get a petition up so you do two hours instead of one. Two hours, yeah. We could even look at expanding it, but we need to build it first. Little acorns, Danny. Little acorns, all that kind of stuff. Little acorns, the great oak scroll. Was you at Red Rose Radio? Yeah, Red Rose Radio, uh, 1992, 30 years ago in June. So you was around when John Myers was around? Very much so. It was John Myers and I that uh, put the phone in together. John was a great guy. Great character, terrific man, you know, taken from us yeah. far too young. Yeah, absolutely. And you know, but he did a lot for radio and he crammed a lot into his life, you know. Yeah, absolutely. Well, good luck with the show. I'll keep listening, mate. All right, Danny, you take great care and good luck with the radio station. Thank you. Take care. A dinky-doo, ta There we are. The, what we've got here, Professor Numpty says, no wonder Kareem can't get through. Everyone else is ringing and ringing and ringing and redialing and redialing and redialing. Uh, sorry about the unintentional typo, my apologies. Not at all, not at all, Dave. No problem. Kareem, keep going. You, you're bound to get through. Kareem must get through, folks. It's so important, I always say. There we are. Now then, who have we got here? I was in the Argyle and Southern Highlanders. The Argyle and Sutherland Highlanders. You're live in Scotty's phone in. Who's that? Hello, Scotty. It's Kitty. Ah, yes. Miracle. <laughs> this is bigger than Marconi. <laughs> How are we, Scotty? Kareem, do you know the story of Marconi discovering radio? Please tell me. Well, very quickly, I'll not take up your, your call, but very quickly, because I love this, and I'd love to have been there. Um, Guigliamo Marconi, I think I've said like Guigliamo, um, he, uh, he got his pal, he said, right, we're all set up now, I am going to broadcast this, if you can hear it, stand up on that mound over there and drop your hanky. So hold up a hanky, and if you hear it, drop it. He transmitted and the hanky dropped. Wow. Now, can you imagine what that moment must have been like? Never been before. And then hearing that, seeing that must have been outstanding. Now, in 1901, I think it was, Marconi, the same boy, he was some boy, he sent a signal across the Atlantic to, I think it was to Nova Scotia. Uh-huh. And, uh, and they picked him up. Now, you think this was 11 years before the Titanic went down. Wow. So the Titanic, yeah. could you imagine nowadays the Titanic would be being watched in a control room, uh -huh. a little radar thing would be moving. She would have a top quality radar on board. They would have seen all the icebergs would have been flashing red with X's likely. You know, they, they would have been talking ship to shore all the time. Even the passengers would have been on their mobiles. Oh, there's a conspiracy theory with that, Scotty. Yes. The Titanic, that it was, I've forgotten it was this. It's sister ship. The Olympic. They, they thought it was the Olympic. Yeah, I thought it was quite interesting. Yes. And they also, there were all sorts of things that, um, there were all sorts of things about, um, that she was racing because it was her maiden voyage and she wanted to look so good. So she was going faster than she should have been going. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You see, in these That's days, cool. Kareem, when you opened up the engines, uh -huh. when the captain said, um, all right, Mr. McDonald, take her to sea, <laughs> right? Uh, yeah. That meant all these poor men down shoveling coal like crazy with wheelbarrows and everything. You know, nowadays you just open an oil valve. And that's it. And, and that's it. And off you go for America. <laughs> wow. You know? Have you ever been on a, a cruise before or anything? Not Sorry. in the big ships. I mean, I know boats. I've worked on boats. I knew all the Clyde schemers intimately. Yeah. You know, the Duchess of Hamilton and the Caledonia and the Waverley, and the Maids and the ABC car ferries, the Queen uh -huh. Mary the Second. All of these I knew inside out, the Loch Fine, the Loch Nevis, the the, the um, Claymore, and uh, the Klansman and the Columba, you know. I knew uh -huh. all these boats intimately, but I've not been on a national cruise. Yes, 
I, I've not been either. But I hear they're just like big hotels in the water. Well, I see them. I see them come into uh, uh, ports around the country. I remember one day traveling to Greenock, and I thought somebody had extended the town. Right. And you could right. see this thing from almost anywhere in the town. Right. It was like a, it, you know, it was just like huge tower blocks at the pier. There's a. Um... It was where is it near? It's near Glasgow Airport. Uh, and I remember questioning when I was when I was in the car. Is that there was actually nearby the airport quite a few ferries uh, parked there for a good number of months during COVID, and, and there were massive ferries. I don't know who owned them or if anybody knows about them, but they they looked fantastic. They really did. They were huge. That might be near Port Glasgow. Right. I'd, 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 I'd need to go past the area, but uh -huh. look at my map. Yes. See where it was. How very so interesting. interesting. Yes, gosh, you're a great fund of information, Kareem. <laughs> Thank you, Scotty. That's <laughs> absolutely incredible. I'll tell you one thing. I had problems with my combi boiler. I think I told you that the last time. I yes. Up. And that's all nice and fixed now. However, I know nothing about the actual heaters. So some of my heaters are cold. So I was bleeding them, as you do. And did you but go, I did you start know, at the high point? Well, I don't know. At the bottom of the heaters, there's like two valves, and I really don't know what ones to touch. To well, to the two out. valves, one will be the inlet, one will be the outlet, right? right. And you're, you're, right. you're anti-clockwise to open a valve. Right. Now, to get the heater working, both these valves will need to be open, so anti-clockwise. But so for bleeding... Yes, but for, right, okay. for do you, do you open both of them, yes. If you want the radiator to work, you can shut the radiator off, as far as I know. But if you're bleeding, you would bleed from the highest point in the system. Yeah. So you'd be probably up in one of the bedrooms. Yeah. Well, I've, I've bled all the heaters. It was just the two bottom ones. and Two bottom ones. If you, you can try them. You can always put it back. But I would say anti-clockwise with them, see what's happening there. I've done what I can for today, but I'll probably have a wee tinker about with it. Yes, it yes, on. you're better uh, not starting something late at night, because if it did all go wrong, it's harder to get a plumber. Yes, absolutely. But no, that was all the thing. But Scott, I don't have too much to say today. Just no, that's to fantastic. I'm just very glad you're on. Um, I mean, you, you you said a fair bit last night, and boy, did they go to town on that. The, it's, I think it's a very good subject, because yes. I think... It really touches a lot of people, um, and I see it a lot in, in, in my field that I work in as well. I'm starting to see it in a lot, of, in a lot of younger and younger people now. Um, and vaping seems to be in fashion. You know, I've I've seen some of the first years vaping as well, um, and I know they say it's a healthier option compared to smoking. But when you've got twelve year olds starting to vape, I, I, I find questions need to be asked. Yes, yes. No, I think you're absolutely right. Yeah, you know, I mean, anything foreign like that brought into the lungs. Very simple. As you know, Kareem, the lungs are for reoxygenating the blood. Yes. You know, and they've got these uh, alveoli, these little air sacs in them. The light upturned leafless trees. Yes. You know, and um, and youngsters are damaging their body. I mean, in our day, it was cigarettes, you know what I mean? I think it's a fashion icon um, at the moment, you know, that the vapes, you get them... Well, there's like one we head. could do without. I think we need another fidget toy out. Yeah, well, true. They've got like LED lights on these vapes, and they do yeah. look very cool, but at the end of the day, it's just a, a substitute for smoking. Well, it'd be a lot cooler uh, without them, I could tell you. <laughs> I agree with that. But I think last night's topics, I think everybody that listens can relate to something regarding uh, drugs and their opinion on it. Um, capital punishment as well. I think we really, I still, I still believe that capital punishment for certain uh, crimes need to be looked at. You need to remember, a lot of people said yesterday, Scotty, um, what if you get it wrong? Back in the day, they didn't have strong DNA tests yeah. that they have. Now you've got the yeah. DNA, they know if that person's been there. Yeah, you know, and I think I do think there's a lot 
more uh, a robust process now compared to what they used to be. Uh, but I do, I still do think for certain crimes, you have to have some form of capital punishment. Yes, I think so. And I think people need to realise that if they've taken a life, you know, then they forfeit their own. I, I do, but I, I think if it's so violent, if it's been raped with it and God knows what else, I really do think, why are we keeping this person, why are yes. we taxpayers' money? Yes, because this well, is a very evil person. Why are they having TV, a radio, their phone? Why have they got privileges? Why are they getting to live life when they brutally take someone else's life away from their family? It's not just that person, obviously, that went through that horrible tragedy, but it's all the people that are connected to that person that have to suffer as well. Absolutely, Kareem. Lovely hearing you again. And dinky do, sir. Listen, have a good night. Speak to you tomorrow. Thanks, Bye -bye. Kareem. All the best, La. There we are. Very fair point. Uh, very smart man, that. Uh, now, what do we got here? Oh, look at your comments. Where's Suzanne? Kareem makes some great points. Well done, Kareem, says Ebri. Absolutely. Get them informed earlier. Secondary school kids vaping in schools is shocking. Kareem's part of the furniture. He needs to be in the room. Good caller. Absolutely, Dave Deprave. I agree with you. So there we are. There's somebody saying it's in primary. Yes, Kareem knows his stuff. Compassionate bloke. The amount of smoke that comes out of these vapes is like a fire going on. Seeing car drivers blowing the smoke out the windows. Professor Numpteed, I thought the car was on fire. You know, I very nearly phoned the fire brigade and I realized it was just some uh, white van man vaping. There we are. If you want to give us a quick call, guys, we'll need to be a very quick call because time is very, very tight. Then we'll have to say goodbye to our lovely TikTokers very shortly. Because that's coming up to the hour. What have we got here? There we are. Love it, says Ross. Hello, Scotty. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you for my lovely red rose. So very good of you. This guy's spamming us. I think we'll get rid of him. There we are. Spamming. Spamming. We're getting spammed. There's a, a spammer away doing the swatty. Absolutely. What else have we got here, guys? Lots of good stuff. I've never been to Scotland, says Sadaf. You would love it, Sadaf, I think. Capital punishment hasn't worked in the USA. Well, they don't use it a lot, I don't think, in the USA. I think if it became far more commonplace for, uh, you know, knife and gun crime. Uh, do you support Palestine? Well, everybody supports Palestine and Israel, of course. They need to need their heads knocking together and stop throwing ordnance at each other. Yes, absolutely. These vapes kids are using, there are different flavors. Well, this is to try and get them doing it. How did you enjoy your trip to Greenock? When were you last there? Not very long ago, Craig. I love Greenock, of course. A fine part of the world, my, my hometown. So there we go. A town I've got a lot of time for. Suzanne, uh, where are you? I think you do, Scotty, when the time comes. Good night, everyone. Thank you, Kareem. Good night. In fact, we're going to have to go now. Right, I'm going to say goodbye to our beautiful TikTokers. Thank you for joining us tonight. It's been superb. Follow me on TikTok. We'll get this uh, uploaded the first few minutes. Very good. What was your street of residence? Oh, I had more than one street of residence, Craig. So there we are, tremendous. Not too far from the Fort Matilda. There we go. Uh, they scrapped catapult punishment because the hangman kept missing his targets. Numpty heat. What are you at? Stop. There we are. Good night and God bless all our beautiful TikTokers. And ta-ra, lads. Dinky-doo. Right, that's our TikTokers gone. The rest of us. We're going to have to go as well. Great show, Scotty. You're the best, sir. Dave Deprave. It was a fantastic show tonight. Thank you to all you beautiful people on Twitch, on YouTube, on LinkedIn, on Facebook, and on TikTok. You are the very, very best. I'll sing you the song. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. 
Goodbye, everybody. Auf Wiedersehen. Au revoir. And a cheery old Scotty McClure saying dinky-doo to every one of you. Good night, God bless, and ta-da-las! <laughs>